it's tough. The tough call on Jesus. The Lord is so powerful. And so many people are out there lost. And I'm here to tell you, understand this, y'all. There is only one God. There's only one God, but there's a billion gods. If you feel me? But there's only one God. But there's a billion gods. You know, there's people that make up gods. Just to have something to look at. You know, people are just like people create robots because they think robots are going to be their god and it's going to become smarter than the human. But that robot can't make a baby, you know. God is a natural god, he's not an artificial god, he's not a wooden god or a stone god, he is God Almighty. I am that I am, yeah. Yahweh. Uh, you know, whatever the God says, you know, his name is a mystery. God's true name is a mystery. And you won't know it until the end, I believe. But, man, you know, there's so many people out there lost. There's only one God. And that God had a son, and his name is Jesus. Or Yeshua. And he came down here and was put up on that cross. They say, my well, pastor say this, he was hung up for our hangups. And he was, he was hung up for our hangups. You know, God ain't gonna hang up on us though. You know, we'll, people, we're man, man will hang up on God in a second. You know, man will sail God up the river for little or nothing, but you know, that's the world, that's men of the world. And we are not of the world. For, for if they were with us, they would have continued with us, right? But they are of the world. And sometimes people are even in relationships to where, you know, one person believes in God, the other one doesn't. And you know, those relationships are hard to work out, but you know, I'm not saying that they don't because God said that, you know, one one of the your spouse's prayers will almost cover the other one and also draw them in to the life of knowing who God is and having a personal relationship with our Creator. And that's what it's all about, having a personal relationship with our Creator. You know, there's so much deception going on and these kids are so lost these kids ain't hearing the bible they're not hearing the scriptures like we heard it when we were young and really i didn't hear that much i heard it from my friends grandmamas my grandmama you know but it wasn't you know a constant thing you know when i was really young we were we had to go to church what three times to a catholic church you know, and I learned that the Catholic religion is a really deceiving religion that, that believes that your prayers don't even get answered by God unless the Pope releases them. They say the Pope releases the prayers for you. And that's why you got all these people worshiping the Pope. I said, don't worship man, don't put your trust in man, you know, don't put faith in a man, you know, the only person you put your faith in is Jesus, the one that was hung up for our hangings, you know, this is just a quick message for you saints, for my subscribers, you know, I thank you for subscribing all my new subscribers thank you for listening to me god bless each and every one of you remember you're the heads not the tails if god could use me he could use you too in jesus precious name we pray amen